Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today we are diving into the fascinating world of information gathering using the powerful Shodan search engine. If you are interested in discovering internet connected devices, services and even potential security vulnerabilities, you are in for a treat. Before we begin, let's quickly understand what Shodan is. Shodan is a search engine that allows you to explore the internet of things, servers and other connected systems. Unlike traditional search engines, Shodan focuses on the technical details of devices, making it a valuable tool for information gathering and cyber security. To begin, you will need a Shodan account. Signing up is a simple and gives you access to more advanced features. Once you are all set, you can start with basic searches by using keywords and filters to find relevant results. So first of all, let's find how you can sign up your account onto the Shodan. In top right corner, you will find one login option. So simply click on login. Here, if you want to register your account, simply click on register. And if you have existing account, you can simply enter your credential and click on login. I will click on register and here you can provide your account details like uh, the username which you want to add to this account, the password, confirm your password, email address and click on create. So like this, you will be able to register your account to Shodan. Now I'm not going to register my account. So I will simply go to the main page of the Shodan. So click on this Shodan icon into the top left corner. If you want to find information about webcams, you can simply search for the webcam keyword and hit the enter button. Now this search query will display all the available webcams onto the internet. So here you can see it is showing me around 6768 webcams and their IP address as well as their location, top ports, organization related to those webcams, webcam product, operating system and many more. And if I click on any of the webcam, it is showing all the open ports related to that webcam as well as web technologies, vulnerabilities around that webcam. signatures and many more details. So this is how you can easily find webcams around the world by using Shodan tool. Now let's level up our game with some advanced filters. Shodan provides a plethora of filters to help you refine your searches and find precisely what you are looking for. From country specific searches to organization based searches, these filters can be incredibly powerful. Suppose if I want to search for the devices which are located into the United States. So what I can do, I can use keyword like country, then colon and US. Hit the enter button. And here you can see I'm able to perform search for the country specific devices. So there are multiple results for the devices around US. So these are the top cities, top open ports, top organization, top products top operating system and if you click on any of the device you will get detailed information about that. So this is how you can easily find country specific devices on Shodan. Now if you want to find devices related to any particular organization like if I want to find around Microsoft I will simply search for the Microsoft click enter as you can see this is showing me all the devices related to the Microsoft organization. You can also find countries around these devices. So like in USA, there are so many devices in China. Also, there are too many devices for the Microsoft. So this is how you can easily gather information around any organization, all of their devices, which are publicly available, their open ports, their vulnerability and so on. As you become more comfortable with Shodan, you can use search queries to uncover specific vulnerabilities in devices and services. Remember, this should only be done ethically and responsibly. Now, if you know any particular service is highly exploitable or vulnerable, and if you want to find devices around that service, so what you can do, suppose I'm going to search for the service Apache 2.4.29, click on search. So this will list all the devices which contains this particular service. And if I click on that device, then I will gather more information about that device and vulnerabilities around that and I can easily exploit those vulnerabilities. 
Shodan isn't just about raw data. It can be used to create visual compelling maps and graphs to understand the distribution of devices and services globally. That wraps up our exploration of advanced Shodan searching techniques for information gathering. I hope you have learned something new and exciting today. Remember, knowledge is a power, but it comes with responsibility. Use Shodan wisely and ethically. If you want to learn more about Shodan, you can just Google it. or i will post more advanced searches related to the shodan tool in the future so just stay tuned if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more tech related content feel free to suggest other topics you would like us to cover until next time stay curious stay safe see you soon